What's up guys, Apple Maniac here, and today I have another app review for you on the app uh, Transformers Dark of the Moon, which of course came out because of the movie that recently came out, and then it's also called Transformers Dark of the Moon, which, uh, which makes logical sense. So this game is alright, it's, I don't know if it's worth $3, I don't think I'd pay for it again. This has, it doesn't have too many levels, like 10, 12 levels right there. Um, you can select between easy, medium, and hard, which is nice. Um, the hard is actually pretty difficult, which is also a good thing, because you want to have a challenge when you pick hard, which is why they have it. You can get achievements, which is nice. Um, and over here, you have the options. And one thing that's weird is when you're playing your own music, it plays your, your music, and it also plays this music at the exact same time. Like, I think it should choose between one of the two. Don't play them both at the same time. That's just weird. Wait. Oh, okay. And, um, yeah, it's pretty much it. There's level select. You can replay them. Although, with this game, there isn't much replayability. I don't know why you'd ever want to. But I'm going to play this one, just the first one, on easy so I don't get destroyed. Just so I can show you how it is. Um, oh, and one more thing. You can... Let me go back, actually. You earn... Where did it go? You're supposed to earn, like, gold, si gold silver, or, uh... Um, like a mask right here. I don't know where it went. Wait, is this saying... It says I didn't beat any of the levels now. That's weird. Well, anyways, when you beat a level, it will put a face right here. It's gold, silver, or bronze. Just determining on how well you beat the level. Just like a lot of other games. So let's play this. And also, you can upgrade your characters, you can get better guns, you can upgrade those guns, you can upgrade your character itself, make him stronger, faster, and ha able to kill more people at once. And uh, that's really cool. Um, right here, you oh, I don't have the button. Gee, that sucks. <laughs> I think I'm going to start a new level then, or just go really quick. Come on. One thing that's stupid also is that they put all the... the uh, conversations into words and it wasn't like spoken which is no one wants to listen to that like it's just not as fun as listening to them talk especially with Optimus Prime's voice that's why we go to the movies his voice is epic okay back whatever all right just trying to go through this really fast so there's fighting you punch with this you can also shoot with this um, right here I'll show you the special ability you can slide that up and target Multiple guys. Let's see if I can get this guy too. No, I can't. Okay. You can target multiple guys, and that's just a quick way to destroy everyone that's in your path. Uh, there's also just a regular special. If it doesn't use the entire full bar, um, but it still works. Oh, see, here's what I wanted to show you. Transform into car. It's cool, but um, the driving's terrible. The controls are awful. It's so hard. Uh, and yeah, it's just not fun driving, but I guess I have to right now. <laughs> and you can still shoot, which is nice. Oh, oh, there's example right there. Okay. Yeah, and I don't get how this stops you, the Optimus Prime, but whatever. It's not too important. Oh, jeez, I guess I'm supposed to still be driving. Come on. Now this bar fills up every time you kill a enemy. I didn't. I uh, probably should have said that earlier. And that's what you use to do your special abilities. And you have that. You have the one I showed you when you slide up, and that's when it has to be full. And that's to target multiple enemies and uh, shoot them with missiles. There's also one more which I want to show you if I could pass this level or get to a place where there are enemies. Here, I'll show you right here. You tap it once and it throws down your knife like that and just shoots it across. That's another cool special move. So this is the game. It's not too great. The graphics are all right. The uh, I don't like this right here. I don't like how it's words. I give it a <coughs> I give it a three and a half out of five, and uh, I don't recommend this because it's just there's no replayability and it barely has any levels. So. It's definitely not worth three dollars. 
Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. And I leave you with one more uh, drawing challenge. If you haven't seen my first drawing challenge, check this one out. And just go to the last minute of the video. Otherwise, just stay tuned and watch this one. And I'll see you in the next video. What's up, guys? Another challenge. So as you can see right, right there, there's another comment asking me to draw a smiley face shooting a bunch of ants. I'm uh, not sure we, where you guys are coming up with these, but I'm just going to keep on doing these because I actually liked it. I don't know. It was fun. And uh, let's see what I can do. So I'm going to draw it, and I'm going to put it in fast mode, put some nice music on, and uh, we'll see how good it is. And there you guys go. We got these smiley face over here, and he's got a gun, and he's shooting a bunch of ants. They even put a little smoke stream right there, just to have an added effect. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you in the next video.